Hey guys, uh, so I'm back out in the garage. I just got home yesterday from work. I'll be home for a week. Um, so I got started um, doing a little bit of, just a little bit of body work down along the bottom here and do a little paint up there. Nothing, nothing major, just a little spray bomb from Napa kind of deal. Um, anyway, we got that kind of worked on. Uh, something else we got is our new shortcut garage. Hard hat stickers came in. So these are just little, little guys, right? They're not, not real big fits in your hand like that. If, and we don't have a lot of subscribers. So if you, if you want one, just let me know. I'll send you one. You don't have to buy them or anything. If you're one of the guys from work, just ask me. I'll give you one. Um, we'll get those out to everyone who wants one. What I did want to talk about today. Oh, guess what? <laughs> My mags came in. Well, three of the four came in. One, two, three. The fourth one is uh, at Fallon's. I'm going to go there after supper and go pick it up. We'll visit my granddaughter at the same time. So that'll be cool. Once I get all four, well, I'm still waiting on tires. They should be here Monday, Tuesday. I'm also planning on putting in that drop kit. And once that's on, I'll put the tires and wheels on. But you know what? Listen, I want to get rid of this seat. As a plan B, what I'd like to do is put in buckets and console, preferably low back buckets from a square body, maybe like out of a blazer or something. I'm not too sure. Um, these seats are kind of special to the panel and the Suburbans. If you watch the front here, as you slide this forward, it actually moves, moves the whole thing moves forward so you can get in to the back, right? I guess good if you got a Suburban and you want your kids to be able to get into the back. Good if you have a panel and you want to access the back for deliveries. But I have a panel and I don't need to get in the back. So I'm thinking buckets and console would work better for me. So if you got a set of square body buckets and console and you want to trade it for something like this, get at me. I'm willing to do that. I don't care if it needs to be reupholstered. So does this. If you had buckets and console and you just want to sell them get at me i'm i'll buy them if you're looking to buy this setup get at me um i'll sell it after i get something um not before though because i may just reupholster it if i can't find what i want in my experience when it comes to rare stuff like this if I'm looking to buy it, it costs a million dollars. If I'm looking to sell it, nobody needs it. And if they do, they'll give you five bucks for it. So I don't have a lot of hopes for getting big bucks for these. But I would like to trade them, ideally. Um, I have a CPP kit. It's, it's a drop spindle, two and a half inches, and then uh some drop coil springs for the front another two inches so that's four and a half inch drop in the front i also have a five inch drop for the back but with my new wheels and tires i'm not sure if i want to drop it that far i think i might try the back out first and uh see how it goes and then if i need to drop it i will you guys run the fan with the furnace filter on it sure it helps keep the dust down let me tell you and especially if you're using a grinder like that with a flapper like i do and then same as these onion boards so you guys onto this onion board stuff yet you know you you mix your filler on there well on here and then you just rip the page off as opposed to bothering the white for cardboard and pieces of steel, pieces of plastic, you can get your mitts on to mix up your filler, right? That's a, that's a win. Anyway, um, that's where we're at. Hopefully I'll, I'll have that updated video for you Monday, Tuesday. I'm going to get after this suspension drop tomorrow and then hopefully have it done by the weekend. And then Monday, Tuesday, get my new tires in, get them mounted, throw them on here before I go back to work and upload a video with the new wheels, tires, and the drop. Um, if you're still hanging around, 
might want to consider consider subscribing. I'd appreciate it. Um, subscribe, ring the bell, comment, share, like, whatever they do. You guys probably know better than I do. Do that. I appreciate it. And I'll get back to work on this thing and hopefully have a cool video for you in just a couple days. Uh, thanks for hanging out. I really appreciate you. Cheers.